Okay, post-mortem keto waffles. Um, you know, it went pretty well. Uh, I will say if I can turn this guy around. I don't know why I'm like struggling with that concept here. Oh, here we go. Um, this was the one with almond butter. Much thicker mix. This is the one that had the cream cheese. Then you actually blended that. So I used uh, the Nutribullet thing, whatever. So almond butter. This was the cream cheese one. Obviously, if you look at my, I'll upload the video of how I like completely bomb the, uh, the, the amount of the cream cheese one to put in the waffle maker. It was a complete and epic fail, but um, they were really good. I would say the one with the cream cheese was, was the fluffier and tastier one. Um, they both had four eggs in them, vanilla, uh, I think salt and baking powder. Um, yeah, but the big difference was well, one batch was like much bigger and I knew going into it, it was going to be a, you know, a lot more of food, but uh, that would be this one. That's the almond, the one with almond butter. And then this is the one with cream cheese, much smaller. If you look at the recipes that I posted, if it's just you, just do the cream cheese one or cut the uh, almond one in half. Like that's just too much food. Especially if you're calorie restricted. I actually ate two full waffles. Probably more than I uh, needed, but whatever. I'll just go, uh, I'll just go uh, clean off the uh, ice rig today and burn off those extra calories. Hey, Robert, Melissa, Matt, Dreams, Thomas. Yeah, this is what I'll do today. See that, that ice, I will clean uh, about six off and we will burn up any extra calories I got from eating two waffles. So anyway, hope this is helpful. I'll uh, upload a couple pictures and videos that I did and you guys, uh, good luck. Go keto. Boom.